Tonight we are learning more about the death of a five year old child killed by gunfire Saturday. While police haven't officially identified him, family tells us the boy is Jamal Anderson. They are understandably devastated. Our Lauren Linder spoke exclusively with the boy's great grandmother who is struggling to understand how this happened. My baby is gone and he's not coming back. He's not coming back. Wilma Harris is devastated after losing her great grandson, Jamal Anderson. Not that he was sick and left me, but the way he was taken away is heartbreaking. Milwaukee police say the little boy died in a shooting at Mayfair Apartments near Lover's Lane in Silver Spring early Saturday morning. He was just five years old. He was doing something he knew he probably didn't have any business doing and he was in heaven. Wilma shows me her favorite photo of Jamal. She says he was always smiling and loved to give her a high five or a big hug. There is no words that can really explain the love that that child bought on a day to day basis. It hurts her to know she won't get to have those special moments anymore. It just shouldn't have happened. It's too many kids dying senseless death. I mean, they haven't even had an opportunity to live. Wilma says Jamal was at his dad's home when he was shot, but she doesn't know much more than that. I don't know how it happened and it's confusing. There shouldn't have been a gun around that child. So she and her family are looking for answers as they try to cope with Jamal's death. We just want closure. We, we want his body released as soon as the coroner is finished with it so we can go ahead and take care of the final arrangements and everything. Milwaukee police say they have two people in custody in connection with the incident. They're still investigating what led up to the shooting and are asking anyone with information about what happened to call them. Reporting on Milwaukee's northwest side, Lauren Linder, today's TMJ4.